Good evening folks, Alvis51 here. Um, this image that I'm going to show you next, um, I've actually got three images, um, but this main image I did want to put up two days ago and I kind of didn't have the cojones to uh, put it out there until I put this image onto um, the Mars, Moon and Space TV's uh, Facebook um, channel, Facebook page. Um, I put it out there and I said, can somebody tell me, um, basically, if I'm going crazy and is what I see right? Now, uh, one of his fans, Nadia, did actually put some filters over this and said uh, at first she she thought that it was nothing and then uh, she realized that I had something so thank you for that I am now putting this out there so here is what we have yeah, now bear with me with this, please bear with me with this. This image is here in a different light. Um, and what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna show you this weird crater that popped right out of me, like popcorn. It just <laughs> straight out. I was like, this, I can't quite figure out what's wrong with this crater. When I was looking at it, I was like, what is There's something weird about that? It's it's almost like it's something camouflaged within the crater. And you'll see what I mean now. I hope you do anyway. Um, so just watch here. You see that? You see what's going on underneath that crater? That has something hovering straight over it. And that's not you. I'll, I'll leave the actual um, majig, the um, where I originally got this from. I'll leave that in the description below. Um, but there's something odd about this crater, there really is. Back to the original form. Um, let's just do something with the brightness for you. So you can see without me getting rid of the detail so much. I hope you can see that, we'll go with that. Um, if you look at this crater here, you can see detail on this bit here. So I did originally think, it's just a, it, it's a bit weird looking that bit, it's just a, an imprint so you know like when you get some play-doh or plasticine or blue tack or whatever you put your finger in it and you put your finger right next to it and you've got two little indentations I kind of thought just two indentations on the moon um, but it doesn't make sense the, the 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 more I look at this image it it does not make any sense whatsoever it's it's one of the things that's just messing with my head. Um, this has got a real glare to it. Whereas a normal crater, you, you, it's got a glare, yeah, but you can still see the actual detail of the crater itself in this image. There's something, this, this is it's almost like, this is from Apollo 8, by the way. The Apollo 8, astronauts flew straight over it and they were taking pictures and they may not have even noticed this or they did notice it and they thought you know what let's bang that image out they can't see that but I don't see why they do that <laughs> I mean please leave in the comments if you think that yes this guy's absolutely crazy and he's seen things because I don't do this channel just to you know I'm always the things that you know let's make a channel I'll, I'll do it 
what should I do? And I'll do it on aliens and UFOs. Don't really believe in them, but let's just bang it out there. I actually do believe in this, um, and I think it's crazy not to, but that's just me. Um, there's something so weird about this image. I mean, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to show you when I adjust the contrast again on this um, adjustment. Let's just do the exposure, sorry. Um, let's just, let me, I need to show you. Do you see that? Do you see what I'm talking about? This thing is almost like it's it's over the crater. Now I'm not great with Photoshop, and I won't pretend to be. Um, but before I even Photoshopping this image, so let's cancel that. I saw it. And there's something just about it. there. There really is. It's, it's, it is bizarre. I can't quite put my finger on. Well, I can put my finger on why it's bizarre because it looks like a UFO. Let's face it. It looks like a UFO. Or it looks like a giant dome that's a, above the surface of the moon, um, hidden within the crater. Which a lot of YouTubers have put out that they have seen. Uh, craters that are gleaming. Um, I'm going to show you a couple more images from the same file that I got of Apollo 8 and this one here you've got some sort of what could only be described as um, a well, let me zoom in because you're not going to see that if you're on a smartphone or whatever periscope, a giant periscope coming out of the moon's surface. I mean, there's a lot of these images that people put out there because I will tell you this, in these NASA images that they get, like look at this over the crater here, that there is absolutely nothing because you get that on these old film, I don't know what it is. But you can tell the difference if you really look and that's not that is not that is something that's on the moon's surface um that is popping up to say hello it's uh i don't know it's like a little satellite dish or something i don't know what it could be but i genuinely think there's there's things on the moon and it's probably made me the reason why we've not been back or the reason why um, we are there already we're just not allowed to know that we're there um, I don't know the answer to that but these astronauts they saw things out there they saw things on the moon I'm telling you they did um, this next image Let me bring this over for you. So this one I have put into Photoshop and just brightened it. And you, this is what I mean by all this fuzz that you get on these old cameras. It's everywhere. And it's not UFOs, it is just, I mean, you could put that out there and go, well, look at that. There is a UFO there that looks like a piece of glass. It's nothing, it's just the camera um, I don't know the technical term behind it, but don't be fooled by that because some people will say that something's something when it's not. But this here, you zoom out again, the same Apollo 8 film. You're probably looking at this still, aren't you? And, and is, I'm all crazy. Um, I saw this and I thought, what is that? popping up in the distance so I'll zoom in and you can see it's like a, a tower just there you can see the base of it you can't see whatever's in the middle if there is anything in the middle 
and then you've got that thing over the top of it. I mean, whether it's something coming down to land, whether it is a tower going up and it's just got the edge at the bottom that sticks out more than what's ever in the middle and then the top, but I, I can see that. But the main thing, I mean, these could be anything, but the main thing that I wanted to focus on was this, because this image To me is it's one of them that I think it's a bit of a beauty because I can't work it out I can't work this image out and so many of you will be out there thinking what is he looking at but I've got an eye for it I have got an eye for this um, and a lot of people out there do as well so you've got to really really look at it if you're interested in this type of thing, I highly recommend the link that I give you for this image. You download the little file. Um, there's loads of NASA images in there as well. You download this one or, or the full, full, full film and you fiddle about this image, contrast, whatever, look at it at different angles and ask yourself, is that two craters? Or is that something disguised within the crater? I'm Alvis51. Please subscribe to my channel. Um, I'm dedicated to putting what I believe is anomalies out there. That I mean, I believe in this. I do, and it's not. It's nothing fake. I just want to know what's going on, just like everybody else does. And this could be nothing. But if it's nothing, it's more like one of them magic eye pictures because it's messing with my head and I can't quite work it out. I can't even do the magic eye pictures. Don't know, many people who can. But yeah, check this one out for yourself. And uh, you can also follow me on Twitter if you like. Same name, Alvis51. I don't think I'm going to change it. A bit like Elvis, but it's Elvis. I suppose it's because they call me Ollie. Anyway, good night, God bless.